Hey everyone, thanks for tuning into Crypto ZX. I really appreciate you stopping by my channel today. If you're new to the channel, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But now let's get right in today's content. Just a quick disclaimer before we begin I am not a financial advisor. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrencies. Now we will begin talking about Sonom once again, SNM token. What happened? Over the past 24 hours, what caused this massive pump? Like, you know, we saw Sonom go 100x. This is absolutely mind blowing. You know, some people did catch this move. And if you did so, give yourself a pat on the back. And I really, really hope you guys did not get greedy and did lock in some profits because this is very, very rare to see happening in the crypto space. But now let's look at what has happened and is this project still has some room to go up or is this it? We will talk about that. Looking at the price of Sonam token right now, it is currently trading at $2.36. It's still up 775.6% as well as 800% in Bitcoin comparative, also 819% in Ethereum comparative over just the last 24 hours. Market cap is currently sitting at 106 million, but look what's happening with the 24 hour trading volume. It's currently sitting at 970 million, almost at $1 billion, uh, you know, buying volume for this project, which is very, very insane. What caused this? You know, there's a lot of theories going around, uh, you know, that this project was a pump and dump scheme. It's all manipulation, which I did also, and you know, kind of mentioned in my previous video like you know this could be whale manipulation happening for sona because there's no such news about this coin uh, this coin has been uh, under the radar not a lot of development going on from a lot of uh, you know investors telling me it's just a dead coin at the point but it is listed on two exchanges which is binance and bitget but now let's look into the price and see what is going on and where we could be going in the immediate short term. So right away, guys, you guys can see this is absolutely insane. And I really, really hope no one FOMO'd into this project. I always mention you never want to be throwing in your life savings or FOMOing in, especially after these kind of moves, guys. This is absolutely insanely risky. But, you know, now if we do look at the price, let me just show you guys something. It was literally trading at um, 15.8 cents. And it went all the way up to um, so basically 70x in a matter of a day in one single day this project went up 70x which is absolutely insane and even right now after having this massive massive correction uh, happen we are still seeing it up uh, quite a bit right now about 800% in USC comparative and you know now comes the question these kind of scam pumps or like manipulation pumps that you whatever you may want to call it can you make money on these of course you can make money on these depending on when you got in if you got in before this obviously mega uh, moonshot of course you can make some uh, great life-changing gains in a matter of a few days but you know that's not going to happen with every single coin i don't want my viewers or if you are new to the cryptocurrencies, you know, going on Twitter, looking around and saying, oh, you know what, this coin's going to pump, this coin's going to be the next SNM token. No, guys, you guys don't want to be doing that. It's quite risky. But shout out to the people that caught in and made quite a bit of a profit. But in my case, what I've learned from the past is, you know, if I see a project that goes three, four hundred percent, I've seen that happen. And before I always put a stop loss. So in the stop loss, in the sense, you know, if the price drops for a specific price, then I will have all my profits, um, you know, kind of saved because uh, these kind of wicks are quite big and this could be massive like you know whales uh there are like binance is the biggest whale that is holding sonam token and obviously there are some big holders as well they probably dumped their massive bag that they bought back around the 0 0.002 cents mark even back in like 2017 2018 some people made like 20,000 x if you were picking up some sonam tokens around there but now comes a question that a lot of people want to know is sonam still going to have a double pump you know, is it going to have a double pump back to these prices or is this it? And we're going to see it go back to that 32 cents mark. That 
is going to be very uh, you know interesting to see how it happens obviously if I do bring out the measuring tool for you guys if we look at this massive wick all the way to $13.88 guys you know it has pulled down 84% since then so a massive massive drop without a doubt happened uh, for the price but despite that fact if people got in around this range if they were accumulating around here you got lucky you basically have um, easiest way to make some money during the bear market so kudos goes to you but i if i were you i would be locking in these profits right now you know a lot of people tend to think hey you know what oh my god sonam went to 13 dollars. i'm going to wait for the pump to happen again you don't want to be waiting for another pump guys especially if you're up 800 percent like i cannot stress this enough i've been hearing a lot of comments you know on twitter stating that people bought in around 11 or 12 dollars this is absolutely insane guys and this is the danger of a fomo you'd never want to be following into projects like these especially after these kind of wicks without any sort of news because this shows that you know this is manipulation 100 percent happening and with sonam that's exactly what we have just seen happen over the past uh you know 24 to 48 hours but we will see what happens in the next uh you know few hours if this project does have more uh for itself to head back towards the upside maybe a three to four dollar range but really really risky and i encourage everyone everyone to stay away at this point if you do still have money in it please have stop losses set in place just in case if the price were to dump even further so your profits are safe especially if you're on binance always have your stop losses set in place i cannot stress this enough i can't see you know my viewers because i care a lot about my viewers i don't want you guys to be um, you know losing insane amount of gains in a matter of seconds just because you know we tend to get greedy and including myself i'm not saying i don't get greedy i get greedy as well uh, but please guys do not get greedy lock in your profits and uh, you know go from there maybe invest into a safer coin uh, that has development that you have done your due diligence and research on that's how you win this market but not but you know also there's a lot of people saying oh yeah now there's another new token coming sonam token uh part two maybe with some other altcoin a lot of busd pairs are skyrocketing on the binance uh, side because maybe the ftx money is flowing into uh, these busd coins who knows that could possibly be the case as well that's a lot uh, of um you know things maybe obviously the only insiders know but maybe that could be the case that ftx money is flowing into these coins that have not pumped that have been dead for quite some time with low circulation supply uh, we have been seeing that happen especially after the sonam token massive pump that we have seen which has literally shocked the entire space uh, but uh, that is it for today's update i would love to know your insight love to know your thoughts where you could see this project go do you think it's heading back down to that 14 cents mark or do you think that this project might pump further let me know down below and let me know what you guys are doing and uh, let me know also that if you got in before this massive massive pump and if you did please once again lock in your profits but at the end of the day you guys do what works for you i just want to help out my viewers but do not forget to like comment and subscribe i will see you guys tomorrow it's been crypto zx and peace out